Hello guys, I'm Dracon. Welcome to Dracoverse. Let's play some more Hearthstone Battlegrounds with Forest Warden Omu. And your support is very, very valuable to me, guys. So don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And please do help me reach my sub goal of 200 subscribers. It would really, really be helpful. Okay, this lobby looks pretty okay. All right, fun. Yeah, now uh, let's start with the token and let's move on. Hell yeah, let's go. That is fabulous. So there are no mechs and dragons. Okay, so mid game is going to be kind of late. Sorry, kind of weak and uh, dragons late game is also going to be weak. So people are going to try to push for demons, murlocs or maybe even beasts. Beasts are actually really good. If you guys have not checked out my Mayav video where I beat golden razor gore caligos build with beast man that was crazy so yeah i want you guys to go check that out if you guys have not it's it's really like, like really really good wow he has tess okay this could actually work in this lobby test in this meta test could actually really work wow I like this quite a lot. It's a double. And and it's also gold. So I want to have the water droplet in front. Because giving him Selemental is like... It's like giving him like two gold. Or extra one gold for free. I don't want to do that. So let's give him a water droplet. That was good. Okay, let's go for this actually. I feel like this is okay. So next turn I tear up, I buy and play, we'll have 5 minions by like 6 gold which is actually really good. I'm pretty sure this guy is gonna be furious. Cause look at the board, by 5 gold we have 4 minions, they are not like, like that weak really really strong tier 4 so wow mm -hmm. might of the storm wind let's tear up yes let's buy this play this and play this and oh my god <laughs> this is a this is an amazing miracle board And uh, he also has a really, really good board. Okay, that was a good trade. Uh, that's bad. That's even worse. Okay, that's fine. Uh, it could be a... Yeah. Okay, it could be one less damage or the equal amount of damage. That's alright. Four damage is not a big deal. Holy shiz! This is a god roll right here. So this is a buy and this is a buy. So play this in here. Yeah, play this in here. Uh huh. Now what you do is you freeze for this next turn. Tear up. Buy this. Give up on this. Or nah, give up on this. Get the double and find a brand and just like stabilize. That's it. GG. Oh. He actually had a pretty good board. I mean like pretty strong. So he gets a triple for free next turn but he is only at tier 3. Oh he is only at tier 2. Wow. Oh my god. Okay, that's even worse. Yeah, so tear up. That is a buy. I'm gonna give up on this. 
Yeah, I'm gonna play this and I'm gonna sell that. I gave up on that because I could hit a uh, like a burgurgle and this Murloc is like really really nice. Let me go for faceless tab and go. According to me, this is I think strong enough for uh, turn what turn five, turn six, whatever. We could like lose this. It's it's possible for us to lose. Mm. Oh wow. Okay, we lost this, like guaranteed. These trades are awfully bad. The, uh, the trades, they were just worst. That is another six. So are there, oh, there are no mechs. So Greybor is like suffering, kinda. Uh, okay, whatever. I don't like anything there. I like this. I like this quite a lot. Give up on this. Use this in here. Buy this and play. So an elemental check. I must have uh, bought the cave hydra. Oh my. But this is like double light fang is so good. So we have like four murlocs. Um, I'm just going to put these guys at last. Then I'm going to put this guy in front. So I need to hit, uh, there are beasts, so Cave Hydra would be amazing. Or next turn if I get on the house, I go up a tier, find a, find a Malgron, that would be amazing as well. There are a lot of stuff that I would love next turn. No pirate, pirate not, not a big deal. Good, uh, we have a good, uh, oh, what is that, elemental, really, really amazing elemental. So yeah, we could, oh wow, oh wow, okay. By the way, this was just turn, uh, I think, 7. Turn 7 and this is my board. That was bad. That turned out to be good. That was also bad. What in the world? The trades are so awful. Jeez. The trades, holy shit. Is he a tier? He's a tier 4. The trades were awful. That's another six, okay. Let's see if I get uh, on the house or not. No on the house. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually go for unlimited coin. I'm gonna buy this because that's a double. That's a really good demon. So roll over. That is a brand. Give up on this, uh-huh. So I, uh... Oof. Okay, roll once again. <laughs> roll again. Ah, uh, fine. I think what I'm gonna do is actually play the brand first. Yeah, now I probably think I give up on this. Then I do this. Uh huh. Re roll. Let me see if I could hit a triple on that. Which I cannot. I don't want to give up on this. This is a double, but it's taking way too much space now. Uh, let's do this then. Fine. I think this is alright. <laughs> Turn 8. This is my board. Turn 8, by the way. Unreal. Actually unreal. So he's getting Void Walker, not the Bran or Light Fang, which is actually huge. It's a tie. Fine. Fine, alright. Is he at, uh, he's at tier 5. Okay, so tier up for me this turn actually. 
nothing's good yo tear up yeah reroll get an amalgadon or something wow that's a good demon hurry uh, that's a good beast Really no, no. That's that's a bait, clear bait. Cause we already have double light fang. I have to hit another like yeah. I have to hit a golden light fang, or I have to give up on the brand. Not bad actually. He has a really really strong board. But I don't think he's going to be able to win if the cleave hits the right. Oh my god, that's a that's a wonderful cleave. Not the poisonous. That's fabulous. That is amazing as well. Oh, okay. Unlucky guy. The tier 5 survives. Actually, this is so freaking strong, man. Holy shiz. So, faceless. Why would I need a faceless? Ah, I'll take the faceless. Because no one, no others would uh, get their hands on it. That's a good one. That could... No, no. Using the faceless on that is just, like, not good. No, that's overkill. Come on. Really? Okay, let's go for that. Hmm, not bad actually. He has a solid board. But I don't think that solid board is gonna help him that much. It's it's not. Not at all helping. Jeez, that's so unlucky. That is lucky. Like, if this would have traded into, uh, yeah, this guy, he would have been creamed. Okay, that's still a lot of damage. That's still 15. By the way, this guy is number 2 place. Oh my god. Like, it's just absurd how strong, like, Omu is. It is literally absurd. What is Rafam playing? Oh, Rafam is playing beasts. Okay. That could get, uh... That could get really bad, really fast. Mm, okay, let's go for this. Uh, I don't have a pirate, right? Yeah, that's the reason. Fantastic. Because I could get an Amalgadon here. It's possible. You know what? I'm going to use this on this just to get an Amalgadon. Just to get an Amalgadon. Come on, really? OMG, that is annoying. <laughs> okay. Okay, fine. I'll just play this. But to be frank, oh my god. Not getting a Malgadon is just so bad. I hit two triples at tier 6 and I have been rolling as well and I don't seem to find the amalgam that I actually require. And he has my amalgadons. I don't think he wins actually. Yeah, my cleave is just uh, too strong for him. Or maybe like he, oh yes, oh yes, he does not win. I don't think there is a chance for him to win actually. Mm, that was an okay trade, I'll take that. Lucky trade right there, uh-huh. Fantastic. That is actually pretty good. So do that, yeah, do that. Uh, Tell me it's not something that spawns stuff. Okay. Phenomenal. 
I'll take that. Oh, he he could go for the pirate. Oh, that build is really annoying. OMG, that that build is really really annoying. Mm, okay, fine. Okay, I'm gonna go for buy the holy light or training session, because my hero power is dead. But by the holy light could give this divine shield, which is so so huge. Elistra is good. Let's go for Elistra. Buy that. Yeah, this is a buy. Reroll. Um. Please. No amalgadon. Come on. Okay, that could give me an amalgadon. So I'm gonna do this. First off, let's do this and then let's freeze because I'm a boomer. <laughs> okay, this is good. Not bad. Not bad for uh, turn 12. Perfectly when he's out. Close to perfect. And 30 damage just like that. Oof. That's gotta hurt. 30 damage just like that. Wow. 103 seconds. Okay. So yeah, this is a buy and this is a buy. I buy this because I have a Lystra. Simple. So first, play this in here. Sell this. Yeah, play this. Okay. Mm -hmm. Fine. Uh, that could give me an Amalgadon. And that's actually free when you have a Bran. That's why I'm not giving up on the Bran. Bran is just so, so good. Jesus Christ, that is bad. Uh, that's actually good. That is another Alistra, that's a stat boost. I think I'll go for the stat boost, giving up on the Alistra. Like actually, if you have a huge cleave, that, that works in your favor. Never lucky. Never, never lucky. What's he playing? He's playing beasts. Okay, let me put this guy in front and then this guy in second. Or maybe, nah, I'll, I'll put this in front. Yeah, and then this in second. Because he might have a Lystra as well. So this is actually pretty good. Oh, oh, I see. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay, this guy is just dead. Straight off. But instead of Golden, he has a Fendish Servant. Which is not even bad. Like, really? It's not even bad. Holy shit, that's a good idea. But at the same time, he is dead here. Yeah, that's, that's just like, done. He's done for. That is so much damage. Oh my god. Omu is just unreal. Omu is just freaking unreal, dude. What the hell? Jeez. She is just so freaking good. Hmm. Not good, not good. I'm looking for an Amalgadon, which I, I, I'm just not able to find. Which I did find. 
Okay, so I give up on this since he's playing. Now nah, wait a minute. He he actually had a amalgam with divine shield wind fury. Having this is pretty good. I'm gonna play this next turn actually then. Okay, so if if next turn is the last turn, I will be giving up on the light fang. I will play the bran. Oh, sorry, not Bran. I'll play the Amalgadon. I'm not giving up the Bran. That's because I wanted to adapt eight times to guarantee Divine Shield and Poisonous. And if I miss out on the Divine Shield, it's of no use because there are no mechs. I cannot give this Divine Shield. I cannot fix this. Oh. 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 Why would you give up on... Fine. Okay. As long as I win, I don't mind. Man, I would have played this this turn. Jeez, there's no way. There's no way he's winning this. Jeez, these stats are like unrealistic. How in the world are they tying with this? Maybe I just high roll like crazy. I'm not sure. Okay, but this guy, like, let's be frank. Almost one of the freaking messed up heroes, according to me. Really. Huh. So, yeah, rerolls. Let's see. Okay, that, that I could fix that, because I could get a Poisonous Minion. Or Toxfin, actually. I don't like... Oh, yes, that's nice. So, yeah, sell that. Play this in here. Sell this one as well. Reroll, uh, if I could find some stat boost. Wow, that's amazing. So, reroll, yeah. P do this in here and place this in here. So that actually changes quite a lot. Wait, what? What? Oh my god, okay, whatever. This is but a crazy build. I don't think he can take out this. Oh yes, he cannot take out this. And that cleave <laughs> did its job perfectly. Oh my god, the highest roll ever with Omo. This is turn 15, I think. Turn 15, and look at the stats, and look at the, um, what is that? The synergy. Divine Shields, a huge-ass cleave, double Amalgadons with Divine Shield, Poisonous, oh my god. And those, don't ask about MMR, because yesterday was a worse day. That's why you do not see any videos yesterday. Man, it was... It was brutal. I was out by turn 7 or 8 all the time. I recorded for 5 hours straight. I just could not take it. So I just scrapped everything. Took a break for a day. Anyways guys, thank you so much for watching. See you guys tomorrow with another wonderful video. Until then, signing off. Dracoverse.